Grotto and Abyss in a Monsters Ball match. I will say the video package for this did a great job of explaining the issues between these two men. Hey, the video packages on this show up and down were great. They did a very good job on all of the video packages. I will say that. So, Joseph, uh, for those of you who don't watch, Joseph Park is Grotto's agent, I guess. But they had a falling out, and so Joseph booked Grotto versus his brother Abyss in a Monsters Ball match, and Grotto must win to get the uh, possession of his visa so he can keep wrestling in North America. So they're doing this match, and it's just immediately... Kicks to the balls, weapon shots, staple to the head, cheese grater to the nuts, trash can to the head. Grotto goes off the top rope through barbed wire on the floor. Oh, God. God bless Grado. Is it Grado <laughs> or Grotto? I don't know. If I'm saying it wrong, let me know. I think it's Grado. Okay, I'll say Grado then. He's a very, very talented guy in a lot of ways. He's very funny. He's very charismatic. He is one of the most uncoordinated people I've ever seen in professional wrestling. That was... Evident by the end of this match, too. He could not get on the top rope. No, he could not climb. He did this at least two times. There may have been more. He can get to the second rope, but to get from the second rope to the top rope is like the battle of a lifetime. The battle of a lifetime. Yeah. It was... <sighs> so they kept on going. They hit uh, each other with stuff. Do we mention that? Uh, we had Grotto during his during his comeback in a weapons filled blood feud with his literally his global citizenship at stake. He does comedy spots where he imitates Dusty Rhodes and New Jack. We had Abyss bumping onto a barbed wire board. This is so important they had to cut to Van Ness in the crowd again. Although there was a point to that because eventually she hit the ring. She nut shots Grado, hits a kill switch. Crowd had no idea what to make of this. Nor to die, frankly. Lights go out. When they come back on, Rosemary is in the ring. So Rosemary attacks Van Ness. She has a stare down with Abyss. He goes to kill her. She talks him out of it. But then she accidentally spits mist in his face. Now he's blind. He chokes them with her in a thumbtacks. This is already a bad mass, a bad match, and a mess. And I'm confused. And then Grotto hits a schoolboy. Schoolboy. Not enough. He knew he no. Referee. Ref counts two. And the bell rings. And the wrestlers look at each other. And the ref jumps up and waves it off. No, no, I said two, motherfucker. The announcers had no idea what was going on. I had no idea what was going on. So Abyss goes for, I guess, a choke slam. They fucked it up like three times and gave up. It was supposed to be a black hole slam onto the board. There's never been anybody in the world. I'm including you watching TNA. Nobody has ever wanted to do anything less than Grado taking this bump onto the barbed wire board. Yeah. They fucked it up over and over and over again. And finally, Abyss gets him up and spins him barely. And the problem is, let me tell you something as a pro wrestler. You just got to go up. <laughs> because if you try to not, it's going to end up worse. If you try to avoid taking the bump, something's going to get fucked up. He did not want to go for this black hole slam through the table. And finally, Abyss spun him around and just fucking... He fell on him with every ounce of his weight onto the barbed wire board and fucking nearly killed the guy. I was like, I hope you learned a lesson here, Grado. First off, don't do these bullshit matches. And second, like, if you don't want to take the bump, then you need to go over it before the match and not agree to do it and then not want to do it in the heat of the moment. So when this was said and done, I didn't really... I, I understood the issue between the two men, but I didn't know who I was supposed to cheer for or who I was supposed to boo. I had no idea what the uh, relationships with the women were with each other or with either guy. So this left me only to enjoy the wrestling, and the wrestling fucking sucked. <laughs> it was really horrible. I went negative two stars on that one. Man, I don't know if I can argue that. It was very, very bad. 